Hi everybody, it's Andrew Roboto here, and as promised, I will be doing part two of all the problems and stuff I I've first done. So um, cause a few weeks ago I released part one, which for those who haven't um watched yet, I will provide it in the in the I will provide the link in the description below. But anyways, let's start off right now. So this first one is a book called Jarhead, which is by Anthony Swafford. Or, uh, S yeah, Swafford. I f Sorry if I said his name wrong. But, um, this book I got from Daniel. And, um, it has to do with the Gulf War. That's what this book has to do with. And then I also got, um, the Battle of Antietam. Um, the same day I got this one. And this one, this one is by Ted Alexander. And it also has to do with the war. Which was the bloodiest war. So yeah, except this one's hardcover, that one's paperback. So yeah. And um, another thing I got from Daniel is this DS. Which um, of course it says his name on it. Which some of it's torn off, but it's supposed to say Daniel Steinberg. Because that's his last name. And um, this is a red and black DS. He gave it to me. And, and I got the DS games, the charger, and the case. The same day I got this. And of course, this thing. This is this is like my third DS, DS Nintendo DS Lite, because I have like two already. That are like this. So yeah. So yeah, I got those same day, and then. And then this wireless fan back here, I got that from a friend Adam, and it's wireless because it, it works like a toy because it takes batteries, and it's actually wireless. And what's cool about it is that you can can move this up and down. And it's missing some parts there, but other than that, it works. And this thing has two settings, low and high, which I'll turn it on. Yeah, I know. Even if I turn it on high, this thing is actually quiet because it's not a suit fan. So yeah, it works, as a, it works as a desk fan, which is cool. And another thing I got is, is this tank, which I got from Daniel. And I got this action figure the same day I got this tank from him. Which this thing has moving parts, and I fixed the treads on this because they were loose. And obviously, this is supposed to be a model, it's not actually a toy, that's why it doesn't make any noise. Yeah, this action figure I got the same day I got this, so yeah. Just one thing I wanted to mention it's got moving parts, and it's a good model. And I've had that for a year. And then another thing I got from him are these two, another thing I got from Daniel are these two comic books. This one has this one's about Captain America, this one's about Spider Man, and then I got. And then, I, and then I got the book about Spider-Man the same day I got these two comics. So yeah, because I do like comics. So yeah, in this video, um, there's not as many... There's not as many stuff in this video, just because... A lot of the stuff is hidden in my room somewhere. Like, all the miscellaneous stuff, like DS games and the other books and chargers. Yeah, those are... Those are hidden in my room. Those are in my room somewhere. So I just brought up the things I wanted to show. That I could show. Because, I mean, part one has more stuff than this. Part one has a lot of stuff, and then part two, there's not as much stuff in this video. So, anyways. And then another thing I got is these two DVDs from Daniel, which are The Day After Tomorrow and Yours, Mine, and Ours. I think I got one of these from either Daniel or Ryan, I'm not sure, but I got these two on different days. The Day After Tomorrow, it has to do with an onset of a new ice stage, and then Yours, Mine, and Ours... Um, has to do with hit with um. Has to do with David running a family, having eight kids. So it has to do with. So yeah, that's what that movie has to do with. And um, I'm gonna check to see if I've showed everything. Yep, that's about it. My other video was a, kind of a long video. This video is not as long because it's not much stuff. So there you have it, part two. I hope you enjoyed watching this, and thanks for watching. Bye.